We're gamers united, where we're gonna play games. You know we're gonna have fun. Plus, we share our gameplay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gamers United. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to another video. We are uh, playing Silent Hill 2. Um, last episode, we uh, uh, went to the Historical Society. We jumped down a couple of holes. We visited the prison. We found uh, Maria unharmed after the whole elevator at the hospital incident. And then we just found her again, and then she's dead again. Oh my gosh. This is some crazy stuff. And we ended just right when we found her body, and now uh, this door is now open because the game wants us to go this way now. Uh, but, um, oh yeah, we also fought, um, I think Angela's uh, dad. I think the whole story is, I, I forget if it's mentioned it yet through the reading, but pretty much her dad was abusive and took advantage of her. Uh, maybe her, maybe she had sisters too, I forget. Um, but I think she uh, got tired of it and actually killed her father, and now she's feeling guilty about it. Oh, and also we saw Eddie, who uh, was talking about shooting people for laughing at him and even taking a, a dog, which is really dark. Um, so there's some really dark characters. Um, the little girl, Laura, she's kind of a little brat, but she's not guilty of anything. She's just thrown into this world, and she, it, it could just be, you know, um, she's just scared. Uh, well, maybe find out later. Uh, Epitaph is inscribed here. The, this felon drank one last bottle of ale before he was executed and laid here to his external, eternal rest. Shotgun shells. The name on the tombstone is to scratch up three. Maria K. Traitor. To scratch up three. Walter Solvman. Oh, the killer. The kids. Saw throw a TV on her supposedly monster father. What's what's his name? James Sunderland. That's us. Oh my gosh! And we're gonna go jump in our own grave. And. What are you doing? 
What does it look like? He always busted my balls. You fat, disgusting piece of shit. You make me sick. Fat ass, you're nothing but a waste of skin. You're so ugly, even your mama don't love you. <clears throat> well, maybe he was right. Maybe I am nothing but a fat, disgusting piece of shit. But you know what? It doesn't matter if you're smart, dumb, ugly, pretty. It's all the same once you're dead. And the corpse can't laugh. Thanks. From now on, if anyone makes fun of me, I'll kill him. Just like that. You gone nuts? Whoa. I knew it. You too. You're just like him, James. Hey, I didn't mean anything. Don't bother. I understand. You've been laughing at me all along, haven't you? Ever since we first met. I'll kill you, James. <laughs> Oh, hey. Shoot me point blank with your gun? Rifle shot? Shotgun shells? No, that's actually... up. years ago? Oh, 
have a mess. Oops. So a tip for this part is um, you want to go directly, you want to go towards the light, <laughs> which is kind of funny in this game. I'm going up. I don't know so where I'm at. Okay. This part is a little confusing. Confusing. Yep, just holding up.
This place hasn't changed at all in three years. for you. What's this? Room 312. That's the room Mary and I stayed in. Mary, are you there? Or maybe I got a hotel map. Alright. Rachel to give to you after I'm gone. I'm far away now in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. Don't be too hard on the sisters. And Laura, about James, I know you hate him because he th you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true he may be a little surely sometimes and he doesn't laugh as much, but underneath he's really a sweet person. Laura, I love you like my very own daughter. If things had worked out differently, I was hoping to adopt you. Happy 8th birthday, Laura. Your friend forever, Mary. Laura, how old are you? Um, I turned 8 last week. So, Mary couldn't have died three years ago. Could, could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Me and Mary talked a lot about Silent Hill. She even showed me all her pictures. She really wanted to come back. That's why I'm here. Maybe you'll get it if you see the other letter. The one, Mary. Huh? 
I must have dropped it. Laura. I've got to find it. Laura. Oh, okay. There's a piano here. I remember how much Mary liked to play the piano. She wasn't very good, but I still love to hear her play. That was so long ago, before we were even married. Why am I thinking of that now? Wow. I think I hear some things. video might be cut short a little bit but that is okay because we are at the hotel which is I think one of the final areas of the game so Mr. James Sunderland, the videotape you forgot here is being kept in the office on the first floor. Key to 312, the room where Mary and I stayed. Save thing. We need to use a save. Did we check this whole whole hallway yet? And there's stairs. So we're done with the first floor at least. Okay, it's locked, so we need something to open that up. Okay. So we gotta remember this room. A uh, cloak room. Let's check the reading room, maybe? There's a book open on the top of the desk. It looks like a medical book. I've already read enough medical books. None of them did ever did any good. Okay. Brochures. Okay. 
So that's all of that. So I guess we'll check the second floor rooms. Oh, and there's a bathroom. Or bathrooms. <clears throat> That's creepy. Here, crying. Third floor is blocked. That would be too easy. James. That was creepy. There's a staircase, there's a hall. Oh, we had a fish key. To oh! I oh, forgot we had a fish key. We could probably use that in the clock cloak room. Okay, here we go. Whew. It is scary when you're just playing a quiet game and it suddenly makes noise. scattered all over the bed. What's this? Okay, so I need something for that. Okay. I want to say there's some paint thinner somewhere, maybe? And get that, um thing uncovered. Can we check that? So now we're going to the...
elevator employee key, okay. One person. So this part sucks. <clears throat> you have to pretty much put all your stuff on the shelf. Just get on the elevator. I'm gonna go to the basement, I think. Or first floor, okay. Cover that basis and check the bathrooms. down the stairs. Let me actually check how many rooms there. 
Can't check here. Too dark, what? Storeroom, let's check storeroom and elevator. Okay. Ow! Came with no label. We did get a can upper. Of light bulbs. Can of thinner. Uh, right here. Okay, so I'll go right. The stairway area and some bathrooms. Let's check the bathrooms first. So now I gotta make it back to <clears throat> my stuff. So I just go straight here into the left. almost three o'clock so I'll probably do one quick thing before I end the video. Alright, well, that's one way. I remember there's one thing I need to do. Some paint thinner. Oh, 
we'll use some thinner on that picture. Dust. Cinderella box, all right. So we got all three uh, boxes, I believe, for a lobby. So we'll just go down there and we will save it. since we have a lovely red square here. If I can get to it. We'll end this video here. Um, possibly finish next time. I don't know. Um, either next time or the time right after that. But... Um, Thank you so much for watching. I'm hoping uh, you enjoyed the Silent Hill 2 game. It's an interesting game. It's depressing through some parts. But uh, it's an interesting kind of perspective on the game. Um, but um, thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Game on and take care. Bye, guys. Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching this video. Both me and Chelsea greatly appreciate it. Um, if you want to subscribe to this channel, see more content, that's cool. If not, that's cool as well. Um, I'm a gamer who likes to play games, talk games, love games, breathe games, all that fun jazz. But uh, everyone out there, have a wonderful night. Take care. And game on, gamers. Bye! Bye!